morning guys and welcome to vlogmas day 15. Currently, I'm on my way to work. It is Monday, December. I don't even know what day it is. It is Monday, December 14th. I cannot believe it. This probably has been the fastest Christmas season I've ever experienced. I don't know if it's because I'm doing Vlogmas or because the crazy world that we live in, I don't know. So it is 7.16 in the morning and I'm on my way to work. What's new? And I'm gonna go to Starbucks. What's new? I think today's gonna be a very chill vlog. I'm going to be watching The Bachelorette tonight and we probably will do something fun for that. And I also was debating on maybe making gingerbread cookies, which I have never done before, and icing them all cute. I feel like I always see them on Pinterest and they always are decorated so nicely. So I kind of want to do that too. And just like watch The Bachelorette, maybe order in some food and bake gingerbread cookies. I think that would be so much fun. Hi there. Hi, could I just do a grande flat white please? Okay. That's everything. I want to pay for somebody behind me, but there's no one behind me. Oh no, there is. Okay, I'm going to pay for them. I always get so nervous to do this, but awesome. Thank you. You too. So I think the last time I picked up this vlog was this morning before I went to work. And it is five o'clock now and I got home I think like half an hour ago, but I'm pretty hungry So what I'm gonna do is order some takeout along with my parents. We're all gonna get takeout tonight It's just one of those nights where you just don't want to cook anything along with bachelorettes on tonight Which I'm very excited about and I'm going to bake some gingerbread cookies and decorate them So it's going to be a super cozy Christmassy night along with some bachelorette which I'm so excited. I think it's a two-parter. I think there's one on tonight and one on tomorrow, which I'm very excited about. Tomorrow I'm getting my hair blonde, so I'm very excited to vlog that. I think I need to go down to the grocery store and grab some molasses as well, so we're gonna do that. But today was a very long day again, and I'm just so happy that tomorrow is my Friday. We're getting pretty close to Christmas now, and I feel like the things that I have planned are pretty exciting, and I can't believe Christmas is so soon and I feel like I haven't like I said watched really any Christmas movies so right now I'm going to order some takeout and then I actually think we're just gonna go pick it up might be a little bit easier I was looking on DoorDash and it said that it was gonna be 51 minutes for it to come and I just don't want to wait that long so I think we're just gonna drive there and get takeout which I feel like is 10 times easier anyway uh, today was a stressful crazy day as Mondays normally are but I am just happy to be home. I also wanna show you guys my outfit. This little sweater is from Aritzia. I got this, I think two years ago. My favorite is that it has a hood on the back. I think it is so, just so cozy. And then just some blue jeans, blue ripped jeans. All right, I'm gonna put the order through now and then we'll go pick it up. I'm off to go to the grocery store now. And I just wanna talk about how much I love this snowy peach berry lip gloss from Bath and Body Works. It is so pretty. I also found a really yummy gingerbread recipe. This isn't like the classic gingerbread, so you can't really decorate them, I feel like. This is what the cookies look like. They look so yummy. So I'm going down to get the ingredients, so I'll see you guys in a little bit. I went to the grocery store and our pickup time for our takeout was at 6.20 and it's 6.47 and we're still waiting. So my dad was pretty hangry, so hopefully he's fine when we get home, but we're still waiting. I honestly think they just didn't even see my order and just forgot to make it, so that's okay. I bought some chips at the grocery store, so I'm eating those right now. But as of right now, we're still waiting for the food and it is almost seven and I still have to bake cookies. I bought all of this stuff though. I found molasses, I found molasses. It was really hard for me to find it. So I had to ask one of like the people working there to find it for me and it was like at the top shelf in the very back. But got the molasses, I got some ginger, and then we're gonna go home, eat dinner, and then bake some cookies.
keeping track of when I've been naughty and nice. So it is a little bit later now. It's time to make the cookies and then we're gonna put on Bachelor in a little bit. But I have everything laid out here and I'm gonna show you guys how to make them. I personally have never made them either. And this is going to be a new experience for both of us. I also have asked on my Instagram for you guys to ask me some questions because I thought while I was baking, I will answer some questions and I haven't done a Q&A in a very long time. So I'm looking right now and I got quite a few. So we're gonna go through them as I'm baking and answer some questions. I have two cups of flour in here already. And then it wants salt, baking soda, cinnamon, cloves, and ginger, and then set aside. So I'll have the recipe in the description box below. I'm not gonna say any of the measurements or anything, so you guys can just check the description box if you guys wanna make them. But I'm just gonna go ahead and start putting everything in, and I'll be answering some questions while I do it. How did you meet your boyfriend? And I met him, we both worked together actually. We worked at a restaurant, um, so he was like the cook, and I was just like the server, and that's how we met. We both work together. Do you have any cute, cheap date ideas? I feel like movie nights are the best. Especially right now, um, gingerbread houses, I feel like are a really fun date idea. Little walks, I feel like just going around, just like two going on car rides. I feel like that's really fun, listening to music and getting coffee or something. I feel like stuff like that is the best. How often do you get your nails done? I try to do it every like two to three weeks. But these nails, I feel like I've had on for like a month and I have not gone to get them done. And I need to soon, but I really want to get um, Christmassy nails. So I'm not entirely sure. Comment down below if you guys have any ideas for Christmassy nails. I'll probably just go on Pinterest and find something. That's what I always do. But yeah, usually like two to three weeks is when I go get them done. Two people asked how I'm doing and that's really sweet that you guys care and I'm doing it very well. I hope you guys are doing good too. How long have you had Sophie? I've had Sophie for I think three years now and then my other dog Sam I've had for four years. What's your favorite app on your phone right now? For YouTube, I'm really liking watching everybody's vlogmases. I've never really been so invested in them and I've actually really enjoyed them this year. I don't know if it's because I'm doing it as well and now I'm like paying more attention to it or I don't know, just like a lot of people that I've been watching. I've been watching Sierra, I think her last name is Furtado, Sierra, but her vlog channel I've been watching. Um, I've been watching Kenzie Elizabeth. I've been watching Chloe's videos, hers are so cute. I've been watching Adeline Morin's videos, like a little bit here and there. Um, but yeah, I feel like I'm just, oh, and Maya Benway's videos. I'm just like invested in all of them and I've never really been like that before, but I'm really enjoying Vlogmas this year, it's awesome. What's my favorite holiday? My favorite holiday would have to be Christmas. I just like that it's the entire month or like two months if you're like me and you start celebrating in November. I feel like the Christmas day itself is fun and all, but I think I just like the season of Christmas the most because it's just so happy and festive. Um, so yeah, Christmas is definitely my favorite holiday. Favorite candy bar? Mmm. We have something called caramel here. It's really yummy. I like Kit Kat bars. I love dairy milk chocolate. Those are like my favorite. They're so good. Oh, and something called a bueno bar. I don't know if you guys ever heard of it. It is like a wafer type chocolate, but the inside is like creamy hazelnut, like a spread inside and it is the best thing ever. I think that's my favorite chocolate, it is so good. What's your dream wedding? Uh, okay, I have two. Either one at Disneyland where they have like the carriage and all the prettiness and you get married in front of the castle, but that's like probably would never ever happen. So like a Christmassy themed wedding, like in the winter time with like pretty lights and Christmas trees everywhere. And I think that would be so cute. I definitely would want to get married in the Christmas season. What's your favorite thing to bake? I enjoy baking cakes because I like decorating them. But I also like oatmeal chocolate chip cookies because one, they're very easy to make and two, they always turn out good. Like I don't feel like, you, I feel like you can't mess up chocolate chip cookies. So I like making those too. Oh, the smell, the smell, the smell. Oh no, this smells like soy sauce. So I was using a whisk before and then it was getting too hard, so I switched to a spoon and it's looking, it's looking pretty good. 
Uh, before they go in the oven, you have to roll them around in sugar and then they bake for 10 minutes. I was also debating on buying Hershey Kisses and then putting them on top of each cookie. My grandma does that and they're so yummy. Um, so I was thinking about doing that, but I actually couldn't find Hershey Kisses. I didn't really look that hard, but I couldn't find them. Um, so I think if these turn out next time, I will definitely add that because it sounds really good. But this is looking, for my first time ever making gingerbread, I feel like it looks pretty good. So it says you need tablespoon size little balls of dough. So I'm going to take a little bit here. That should probably be good. And then roll it up. And then it says to roll it around in the sugar. And then once you've put it on your little cookie sheet to flatten it down a little bit. try one of these you're breaking in half though they're still warm they smell really good those are so good I don't know if it's because they're warm and they just came out of the oven they just I did like these actually taste like gingerbread cookies I did not think that these were gonna turn out and they did I will definitely put the recipe in the description box for you guys so you guys can try these out as well because I think these are the perfect Christmas treat. Mmm, look at these. Wow. Mm, yummy. Cheers. Cheers. Not bad. Woohoo! It's good. So, it is late now. Well, not late. Well, it's late for me because I go to bed so early. It is almost 9.30, so we are gonna put on The Bachelorette and I'm going to edit this entire video. But I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe and try these cookies because they're so good. And I will see you guys tomorrow.